Hey yo, uh, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be doing a couple missions, as well as buying a new island and making a new boat. So hopefully we can get all that done. That's our goal for today. So if you haven't already, don't forget to like, subscribe, and join the Discord. It'll be linked down below, and while you're at it, you might as well turn on notifications so you're notified every time I upload. Anyways guys, let's get into the video. So first of all guys, I've done a couple missions and saved a little bit of money. I think I did one mission between the last episode so I can get 56,000 and uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go right here there's a boat that has there's four casualties that need to be tra transported to the uh, hospital which I believe there's a hospital somewhere over here by the town right there so that's what we're gonna do so we're just gonna go ahead and start up the boat and start going so we have quite a ways to go but um, I'll be back with you guys as soon as as soon as I'm there. Alright guys, now that we're here, which took quite a while, uh, we're approaching the ship, so we're going to go ahead and slow ourselves down. Let's probably put a 40% throttle, and we can probably cut the throttle right about now. Alright, let's go check it out. Uh, let's put the transponder down and replace it with the rope. So we'll drop the uh, rope really quick, place it in here. Alright, let's go tie our boat to this boat. And, uh, let's see, tie it to right here, that'll work. All right, so I see one dead already, that's not too big of a deal. I, uh, we should have enough defibrillators, yeah, we have two, that's, that's fine. All right, um, so I can't place them in the driver's seat, I'm just gonna go get the rest. Actually, I'll go ahead and revive uh, her really quickly. All right, cool, so I'm, I'm gonna set them right there. Grab a health kit. There we go. Animal healer. There we go. Grab another health kit really quick. Actually, let's let's actually grab the health kit, not the person. All right. Let's go grab another person really quickly. So there's four casualties. Here's another one. All right. Um. Let's see. Is there? Oh, that's cool. There's a little rib right there. All right. Interesting. I believe the other two people are inside, but. It's fine, we'll get those people last. We'll just place them down right here. Let's revive them. All right, let's heal them. And then let's place them on the bed. All right, cool. Let's go to the next person, which is somewhere in here. Uh, let's see. Um, where are they? Oh, there we go, there's someone. Let's see right there. All right, let's go ahead and grab them. And we will hop back on the boat. There we go. All right, let's go place him in the, this boat right here and quickly revive him from the back because we could not make it on the front. So let's go ahead and jump on right here. Oh, I missed. Ah, uh, come on. Let's see. There we go. All right, cool. Let's place him down. Let's, oh, they're full health. All right, cool. That works fine. There's one more person, though. I'm just curious, where are they? So I'm going to go search the entire ship before I use camera mode, but if I cannot find them, I'm gonna go ahead and use camera mode. It's a little, it's a little bit cheap, but I, I could really use the money for it. So I do not see him in here. It's a cool boat, by the way. Um, it looks pretty cool in my opinion. All right, I do not see him. Maybe we can look around in the dark. Maybe they're in the water somewhere. Nope, they're not in the boat. Let's just double check that. Are they in the boat? Let's see. He not drowned here. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and hop in the boat. Nope, there's no way I could hop in the boat. All right. Uh, let's try use the uh, night vision goggles. Do we see them anywhere? So that's a fish. All right, I don't see him, so I'm just gonna go ahead and use camera mode. All right, let's see. I don't see him right here at the moment. Maybe they're at the bottom of the river. Maybe. Huh. Uh, I don't see him anywhere. Um, that's, that's odd. All right. So it said four casualties, but I'm only seeing three people, but we'll just have to go with all three people and go ahead head to the hospital because I'm not seeing the fourth person 
We will lose out on $2,000, but that's fine. So let's just go ahead and get the rope. If we drop the defibr defibrillator, we'll drop the rope. All right, now we'll go place the rope down right here. And we'll go pick the defibr defibrillator back up. And then we'll go ahead and start the boat and head to the hospital, which is all the way over here, which I can hope I hope I can make it in time. If I can, that would be awesome. If I can't, then then that won't be good, I guess. So yeah, I will see you guys at the hospital or uh, somewhere where the mission ends. So I'll see you guys then. All right, guys. Now we're coming up to where we hop off to go to the hospital. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go right up to it. And then cut the throttle completely like so all right we're gonna go a little further forward farther forward right about here just in case the wind starts blowing the actual boat away uh like that um all right let's go ahead and grab everyone and quickly go ahead and put them on the dock really quickly and then we can get them to follow me to the hospital so Let's go ahead and go all the way up and we'll run in the dark well some of the somewhat of the dark all right cool the hospital is somewhere up here it is right here it's not too far ahead i kind of want to hurry just in case um actually let's not hurry just so we can get everyone there all right cool all right now that we're here we're just gonna go ahead and walk in the door and we got 6,000 from that mission, which leaves us at 63,000. And I know from the past that this island right here costs about 60, 60,000. Yeah, 60,000. So we're just gonna go ahead and go to the boat and go right here so we can actually uh, sell the boat and get a bit extra cash. And yeah, mate guys there. All right guys, we just made it here. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go park this right at that ladder right there. Or actually I'm gonna wedge it right there in between this and the ground. Well, this has in the, the dock. So I'm gonna go ahead and shut the engine off. Shut the power off, there we go. And then I'll hop over to the island and go purchase it. So the purchasing sign is right over there it should cost me 60,000, I'm at 63,000, so I should have roughly 3,000 left, and I don't know how much that'll sell for, but I hopefully will have quite a bit enough, but I hopefully will have quite a bit, so let's go ahead and bring this to the workbench, so let's go over here and enter it, okay, I didn't grab it, so let's go back to this boat it more into this area and then we'll try again all right now that's in this area let's go back to the workbench and try again so let's go to the ladder press f and we'll climb up it and we'll go return it and see see how much we got okay we have 16,000. that's not bad um so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna Go in here and check the price of one of my older vehicles. It has the ability to actually, oh, never mind, not doing that. It did have the ability to transport containers, but it looks like we're gonna have to build another one. So let's go to the train terminal, which is uh, with the $60,000 purchase. And let's go see how much it is to um, make stuff. All right, I just remembered that we can make a flotation helicopter. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make it kind of like a rotor dyne, which uh, has a helicopter blade on the top and then two side uh, blades that can control the yaw and it can also go really quickly. So we're gonna go ahead and make that.
Alright guys, now that the uh, time lapse is finished, um, so my overall thoughts on this is it looks kind of funky, but it works really well. So we're going to use it for the functionality, not the looks. So what we're going to do is we're going to fly to the coordinates of 13, uh, negative 13,000, so right here, and then 0, so negative 13,000, 0. It'll be right here, all right, there. All right, so we're going to go there. That's where the refinery is, and we're going to buy uh, a couple thousand liters of fuel, and then we will go sell it right here. So we can buy 13, uh, 1,600 liters of fuel. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and turn the power on, put the RPS controller to about 5 RPS, it's going to get both engines to 5 RPS. Now we're just going to go 6 RPS. We're going to turn it left. And then we're just going to go ahead and turn on the prop pitch on. That way we can kind of turn, take off like a... Kind of like a uh, float plane. In a way. So we'll just go to 6 RPS. Okay, we'll go to 8 RPS. And there we go. So, let's, um, I'm going to head there, and then I will get back with you guys. Alright guys, so we're coming up onto the refinery, so what we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and turn the prop pitch all the way down, and we're just going to go ahead and land right next to the diesel pump, which is, I believe, the middle one. So, we're just going to go ahead and do that really quickly. We're gonna land right kind of here in the center. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay. That was a little bit close. Um alright. So I'll leave it at 10 RPS. And we're gonna go ahead and land right here. Actually, I'm gonna try to land right in between the two posts. I don't know if it'll work or not, but I'm gonna give it a go. It'll be a lot easier to do if I can, which it looks like I can. I just got to go far enough forward to about right, a little further, right here, maybe? No, all right. I'm just going to go back here, and I'm just going to go ahead and land it just for the safety. There we go. All right, now I'm just gonna cut off the engine by turning the RPS all the way to zero. So I'm just gonna wait for that to slow down. And while I wait for that, I'm just gonna go get the pump so I can start pumping in fuel. All right, guys, I'm just gonna quickly go ahead and fill this up and then I'll be back with you guys. All right, guys, it's finally filled up uh, 1600 liters. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to this location right here to sell the diesel and we should have quite a bit. So let me just pull out a calculator and I will calculate it. Um, so we have 1650 liters. So we'll multiply 650 times, uh, let's see, it's 4.61. So we buy each liter per $1, so $1 a liter, and we sell it for $4.61 a liter. So we will gain 460%. So that'll put us at 6,600 for only uh, 1,600 liters. Now if we add the $563 that we already have, we should be at 7,163. Now, at that point, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back and I'm going to make the tank bigger. And so we will have a bigger capacity and that way we can get more money. And then I'll probably end the episode there or here. So we're just going to go put this to, uh, let's go 11 RPS. We'll turn the starter on. Let's let it rev up. Okay, we can lift up. All right. Let's go set the waypoint. Okay, actually we already have it. All right, we're gonna turn plane mode on right here. 
So let's turn inside lights and navigation lights. All right. Okay, let's go. And all right, so it's only 18 kilometers. Um, I will meet you guys there. All right, guys, I'm here. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna quickly fold the prop. I'll uh, stop it. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and unload all the cargo. So I'm gonna start by hooking this up to right here, and this to here, right here, there we go. So basically I'm gonna start earning money while I get it hooked up with this one, which I believe will make it quicker. So I'm just gonna go ahead and fill up, or sell my fuel and then I'll be back with you guys. All right guys, so I just sold all the fuel and now I'm at 8,200, so somewhere I was off my calculation by about 1,100, somewhere. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end the episode here. So thank you guys all so much for watching. Don't forget to do like, subscribe, and join the Discord. It'll be linked down below. And while you're at it, you might as well turn on notifications so you're not notified every time I upload. Anyways, guys, bye for now.